Submitting a project is pretty simple, and it begins with finding where that project is located. That's usually the week in which it's delivered to you by the professor. So I'm just going to look down here. I know that from the summaries in here that there's a project release for project one, highlighted in green, meaning it's a go. Um, things outlined in red, of course, mean that they're due on that particular week. So under class two, I can see we have a project. So first of all, I need to go into class two. So if I click on that, that will take me into that link. And you'll see, so we scroll down, there are a number of resources, there are homework items, but here's the project, project one headshot. And it gives a project summary, so you can see but it's important to go into the actual project. So if you click here, it brings you into the project. You know that you're inside the project when you see its due date and the rubric. This is really important to help you understand how the work's going to be evaluated. If you want perfect marks, read down the far right and it tells you exactly what you need to do in order to get full marks. This is an area down here where your professor will provide feedback to you, as well as areas in here. So that's very important in terms of gaining some insight into what's going to be measured in the evaluation. You'll notice there's a number of things down here. Um, you know, a video on recapping how to do the project, how to create a layout. Also important um, project requirements or submission requirements. Make sure that you read those. And as you get to the bottom, you'll see that there are two buttons that are of importance to us. One is called Write Submission. So let's say your professor has asked you to submit a URL, perhaps a URL that connects to a portfolio that you're creating on a digital platform. So let's say you want to send a link to that particular thing, you would copy its URL. Now, if we go back, we would simply click the Write Submission box. I would copy that URL from my website using Command C, and then I would I'd issue the Command V and I would paste that in. And if there were multiple URLs, I would paste more and more URLs in there. And then once you've pasted the URL in, you would just click the Submit button down here in the right-hand side. That's how you would submit a URL. And that's under Write Submission. If you're asked to submit a file, <coughs> excuse me, typically a PDF or a JPEG or a PNG, you would have to click this button down here under Attach Files. You can actually just drag your file from the desktop into this area with the dashed line, or you can click Browse My Computer, and that allows you access to locations where your files are, and you click Open, and it attaches the file, and you see it there. And so once you're ready, you would click that Submit button, and the project would be submitted. And that's it for submitting projects.